Hi Me Cuties, we're so excited to let you know that you can now binge our newest series, Influence, exclusively and ad-free on Wondery Plus. It's Meet Cute's modern adaptation of Jane Austen's Persuasion, and we know you're going to love it. Jaden, don't call me. If we're on the phone when the Culinary Institute calls, I'll kill- This will only take a second. I'm at the gallery and Kane's almost here. I need to run this talking point by you. Not the talking points again. Sophie, please. Okay, this Van Gogh guy, what's your impression of him? Do you get it? Because he... Because he was an impressionist. Is that good? I thought it was good. Soph? Or, you know, you could just be yourself. Tell him about the kid you single-handedly convinced not to drop out of school. Or that shelf you built with your bare hands. Okay, Kane's coming. Gotta go. Hey, sorry I'm late. It's cool. Let's go in. I'm so glad you asked me to come. I've, um, been meaning to come to this exhibit. I can't wait to hear what you think. This show is a little out there. I'm hoping to see some cubism. <laughs> Let's go find you some cubism, then. What did you think of this one? The dimensions of this piece are unexpected, making me feel unsettled and off balance. Yeah, I agree, I guess. I, mean, I love it. It makes me feel small. That's actually part of why I moved here, to be surrounded by the mountains and feel part of something bigger. The rat race in the city, it can make people feel too self-important, I think. Art reminds me of my place in the world. Wow, that's beautiful. <clears throat> it, uh, it's pretty avant-garde. I, I didn't know if you'd be into it. I love the work of the avant-garde. Oh, yeah? Who are you into? Too many names to mention. Just so many names that I know. I like that it's unexpected and makes me feel off balance. Mm, you and the brochure. Huh? You're saying what was on the website. I read it too, you know. I don't know anything about art, Kane. That's not why I brought you here. I just wanted to spend time with you. I don't care if you know the terms. I don't know the terms. Honestly, I think most of these paintings suck. What is the art term for this sucks? <laughs> I think sucks is the official term. Well, cubism sucks. It makes me feel anxious and kind of itchy. What if I told you that was the point? That the fact that it's eliciting such a physical response means the artist has done their job. But your work doesn't make me feel itchy. Why isn't your work in here? My stuff isn't anywhere near this good. I have an idea why I showed you something today. So next it's your turn. Take me somewhere. Where do you want to go? Take me somewhere you want to go. Someplace you love. That doesn't suck. And let me ask you questions you know the answers to. I know a place. Hello? Hi, it's Sophie. Sophie? Sophie. I have a vague memory of someone snoring in my car. Is this the same Sophie who drunk dialed me? Kill me. I'm gonna need more than an apology cake to fix this, huh? Apology cake? I've made a cake to begin the groveling process. Can I bring it to you? Meet me at the Art League, but only because I've never heard of an apology cake. Hi. Where should I put the cake? <laughs> Whoa. <gasps> you weren't kidding. Here, I'll take it. It looks incredible. Damn, girl, this cake is heavy. How many layers? Four. That's a nice start. What else can I do? Anything? Anything? Anything but suspension. Bondage is fine. <laughs> Start with sweeping. The broom's in the closet over there. Sweeping. I can do that. And I won't, um, break anything. Again. Don't make promises you can't keep. What? What? I can feel you peeking at me. You're very pretty. Uh-huh. You are. Are you one of those hot girls who pretends they don't know it, 
because that seems like a waste. The dustpan is in the closet. For what? (laughs) The vase you just smashed because you were too busy staring at me. I'm sorry. Oh, God. What's this worth? Sorry, cupcakes? Eh, that's barbs. What else can I do? The windows haven't been cleaned in a while. Those windows? Up there? I'd need a ladder. If you ask the front desk, they can show you where it is. (laughs) I didn't think they'd actually give you a ladder. You... I'm messing with you. There's a guy who cleans those windows. I said no suspension. I know. No ladder. I promise. (laughs) I really am sorry about the other night. I haven't gone on a first date in a while. It's okay. I almost forgive you. Almost? I haven't tested your cake yet. If it's bad, it's over. It won't be. Hmm, someone's confident. I'm sure of myself in the kitchen and nowhere else. Uh, That's how I feel about the studio. And the bedroom. Are you trying to kill me? Sorry I didn't like the art. Don't be sorry. Then where are we? This is my favorite lookout point, but we have to hike a little to get there. Damn. How are you walking so fast? Sorry, I'll slow down. Okay, um, you see that tree right there? The little one? Yeah, grab onto it and use it to pull yourself up. Here, I'll, I'll help you. This tree seems very weak. It's fine, trust me. Here, I'll go first to show you. See? Easy. Your turn. Shit! Ow! My ankle! Oh, God. Oh, oh my God. Uh, let me help you. Oh, c- come on. I- I- I've got you. Let's try to stand up. Oh, no. I, I can't. I'm going to crush you. I don't mind being crushed by those pecs. You enjoy being crushed? Medic, this man needs CPR. His brain is losing oxygen. Do you even know CPR? (laughs) No, of course not. Why do you? Of course. They wouldn't let me out here with a bunch of kids if I didn't. Show me how you do CPR. Hmm. I like the outdoors. I thought I'd spend more time in it, moving here. What do you do all day? Big, scary corporate architecture job. At least it's remote these days. It's that or I'm chained to my easel. Oh, yeah. When is the world going to see the collect works of Cain? Uh, sorry, I don't know your last name. <laughs> when I'm ready, I'm sure. But hey, you're lucky this is your workplace. How are you finding the kids of Green Mountain? Uh, they're not easy, you know? I don't know. What do you mean? I'm used to city kids. Rural kids, different problems, I guess. Honestly, I'm feeling less myself than ever. I'm not sure why I got the promotion, (laughs) but I, I, uh, I'm sure... Sorry, Jaden, I actually think my ankle may need a medic. Really? Are are you okay? I'm fine, but my ankle... Is swelling, rapidly. Shit. I have an ace bandage in the car. I should have brought the first aid kit. What was I thinking? Yeah, not doing a great job at your job. Hey, it's okay. Uh, Look, uh, we're almost to the top, and I really wanted to hear about your work. Forget the stupid lookout. Let's go. Hold on to me, and I'll get you back to the car. Let me put a drop cloth down. We don't want to get crumbs on the floor. Good thinking. That would have been offensive to my meticulous sweeping job. How meticulous could you have been? You spent half the time drooling over me. I should make you get a mop. Hey, you're very distracting, and that's on you. So are you. I didn't get anything done today. Really? I'm distracting? You know, that's a palette knife you're using. It'll have to do. Ready? Ready. Damn. Whoa, what am I even eating? (laughs) It's an apple cider donut cake with bourbon buttercream. Mmm. More, please. (laughs) Mmm, you should be a professional. Does this mean you forgive me? Wait, really? You think? 
funny you should say that because... Apology accepted. That's the best cake I've ever eaten. It is? Okay, but how good? Like, what is your history of cake eating? Are you a Walmart-only kind of woman, or are you... It's this good. Mm. Thank you, apology cake. (laughs) I have a bottle of wine in the staff room. I don't know what type of pairing this cake requires. I can get it. Be right back. Sophie, your phone. Oh my God, grab it. I'm expecting a really important phone call. Hello? Who's on the phone? Are they gone already? It was Lila. Your ex? What? Yeah. Uh, She was calling to ask you to stop leaving her voicemails. She said you've been calling her for months. Shit. Yeah. I can explain. That was the important call you've been waiting for? Honestly, why would you start something with me, Sophie, when you're in love with somebody else? It wasn't... I'm not. I'm over it. Leaving your ex sad voicemails is not being over it. I'm not interested in... It sounds bad when you put it like that. I I was trying to get some closure. She dumped me with, like, no notice. I I... Then get a journal or a therapist, not your ex's voicemail. You left her one yesterday. For goodness sake, Sophie. Why are you talking to me like I'm a child? You're not my parent. You're only a few years older than me. You're making a whole lot of assumptions, and I don't- I can't do this. Is this what you meant when you said you bail? The fantasy gets broken and you're done? That's immature. Okay. You should go home now. Okay, Mom. Wait. Yeah? You forgot your cake. Keep it. It's yours. Are you sure you're okay to be alone? I'll be fine. Call me tomorrow and let me know how you're doing? I will, sure. I'm sorry we didn't get to see the lookout point. It's all my fault. I'm so it's f- fine. Stop apologizing. It's all you do. Good night, Jaden. Good night. Ice cream? What the hell happened to you? I messed up. Was it your talking points? Among other things. Like rendering Kane immobile indefinitely. What'd you do? I'm sure it'll be okay. (laughs) I don't know about that. I was a dick. And Kane's ankle is sprained. He wouldn't even let me take care of him by the end of the day. Did the sprain happen before or after you were a dick? Before? Why? I'm curious about your karma. And Kane's, I guess. Well, this humiliation feels pointed. Will you make me that chocolate ganache cake? You're already eating ice cream. But I get it. We need both. No mirror glaze, please. I can't face myself. Wait, why do you need ice cream? I thought you had the cake and the makeup kissy kissy. Makeup kissy kissy ended in disaster. Uh, Yeah? What does disaster look like for you today, Soph? Lila finally returning my calls and Aja answering the phone. Soph, you were still calling her? Ugh, how did Aja take it? Not great. And I called her mom. Yikes. That's a Freudian slip. I said it on purpose. So now I'm every bit the child Aja thinks I am. Well, I have something that might cheer you up. Unless it'll knock me unconscious, I don't think it'll- Here. This came for you in the mail. What is- Oh my god. The Culinary Institute? How long have you been hiding this, you monster? Ow! It came today. Open the damn thing. No. What if I don't get in? I don't think I can take another emotional ass kicking. Fine. I'll do it. Jaden! You got in, duh. Ah! I got in? Holy crap. I didn't think I'd get in. Of course you did. You're talented, Soph. Thank you. You're crushing me. I can't believe I'm going. But I don't really want to leave you. Honestly, I don't want you to either. But I'm not going anywhere. There's always a place for you here. This will be good for you, Soph. Do you promise? I promise. Jaden, you're going to fix things with Kane. How? 
a grand romantic gesture. Duh!